Hey guys, welcome back to Not Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Uh, today's Wednesday, so let's watch your work on Wednesday. I'm laughing because as soon as I started to talk, I started coughing immediately. <laughs> and it just tickled me. Anyways, yes. So, I'm still wearing my cardigan. It's a different day. What was that other video? The shout out video, I recorded that yesterday. And we're in my worsted girl uh, shirt. But yeah, I'm gonna share more about this cardigan in my next No Catchy Name episode, which will be coming out, um, I'll record it Friday or Saturday whenever I get the time. But not today. I'm gonna take these off because it's really glary. Now I can't see. <laughs> Anyways, I'm rushing this because Devin and Jesse are outside. I can see Devin right now. He's painting uh, a canvas and Jesse's running around playing. <laughs> but I wanted to record this real fast and get it on the computer so I may not actually edit it. <laughs> I have to edit out that first part because I just accidentally choked myself. But <laughs> I'm not gonna edit it uh, a lot so hopefully I don't mess up. But anyways, uh, today I'm, I started a new amigurumi. I actually don't have any other whips going right now except my scrap blanket and I haven't even touched that. I made an amigurumi yesterday and it's really cute but I wanna wait to share it until the No Kitchen episode. But yeah, so I got this green. This is I think tea leaf or sage. I mean, I can't remember. Tea leaf, red heart subscriber tea leaf. And uh, I'm gonna show you the yarns and then you can decide. Oh, y'all yeah, just caught a glimpse of a new bag. This bag is one that I'm making. These are the new bags for the shop. <laughs> glimpse it again. Uh, I still haven't made any of them. I'm, you know, just been busy. But uh, I'm using the one, the first one I made and it's gonna be the ones that I make for the shop are going to be slightly different than this one. This was just like my first prototype one. And I like it. I've been using it like crazy. Okay, so the yarns that I'm using for this amigurumi. Me. Well, they're all scrap balls, so it's kind of hard to... Can you guess what theme it is? <laughs> well, holiday's coming up. <laughs> it's a St. Patrick's Day theme. So I know this is tea leaf. This is like hunter green or something like that. I can't remember. For my heart. Uh, spring green. This is bright yellow, the old bright yellow that was actually really bright. The new bright yellow is like, uh, not like the old bright yellow. And white. And I'm making an amigurumi out of this book that was gifted to me called, I think it's Kawaii Crochet. Woo, the glary. But it says 40 super cute crochet patterns. This was on my wish list on Amazon, I believe, and someone purchased it for me. Actually, I still got the, uh, the note. Here it is, right here. I try to keep my notes together. And um, when people give me gifts, I try to keep the notes with the gifts that I can so that I can always remember who sent it. It's kind of like a ton. It's got a ton of these little Amazon printout things in it. But yeah, I, I don't remember who sent this to me because I think this was an, an anonymous one because <laughs> it's just signed a Yarny friend. But I got the little note in there. And so this is the pattern that I'm making. I just started it. It's a St. Patrick's Day cake. I don't have a green that's this bright green. So the cake is gonna be this uh, tea leaf and then the hat and all that, you know, I showed you those yarns. So it's not gonna look exactly like this one, but it's still gonna have the same uh, essence, <laughs> I hope. <laughs> I need to get a bright green like that. I was, when I was looking at my stash to try to find one, that's what I was thinking, I was like, I don't have that. I have dark greens and light greens, but I don't have like a bright green. So I need to remember that next time I'm at Joann's or somewhere and I can grab me a ball. But yeah, so this is what I got. <laughs> this is all I got so far. And like, I picked out the perfect stitch marker. It's a little uh, four leaf clover. And the little leaves are heart shapes. So I was looking at my stitch marker wall. And that's one good thing about having a ton of stitch markers uh, being gifted to you and buying them. Is you can always theme them. <laughs> so I got a cute little themed one for this project. So this is the bottom of the cake. That's all I got started. I literally just started it. <laughs> and I'm gonna take it outside with me in a few minutes and work on it while the boys are out doing their thing. It feels really good here today. It's in the 50s, so it's really nice for us. And it's supposed to stay like in the 50s and 60s. Uh, hopefully from now on, you know, until summer and it gets hot. I don't know if we're gonna dip back down to another cold front, but we are expecting more rain next week, but it's still calling for like 60s. So it's gonna be warm, but rainy, <laughs> which I'm okay with. It's better than like cold and snowy. I'm all so over snow. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what I'm working on today. It's a cute little um, St. Patrick's Day cake. I will be putting him somewhere in my living room, up on one of my shelves or on our little mantle to go with my other St. Patrick's Day decorations, which are already up. And um, I love I love decorating for holidays. Like if you, if you follow me, you know that. <laughs> but uh, I'm looking really forward to putting Easter up this year. I don't know, I'm just really excited for spring coming. So on um, the 17th of March, uh, well, not the 17th, probably the 18th, the day after St. Patrick's Day, I will be taking down all of this green stuff <laughs> and putting up all my Easter and spring themed 
uh, decorations. I want to get over to the Dollar Tree and check out and see what they got new this year for spring because I haven't been since they had the Valentine's Day stuff up. So I'm sure they got some cute um, Easter things that I want to check out because you can never have too many decorations. <laughs> I've been actually min minimalizing a lot lately, getting rid of a lot of stuff, but I'm keeping my decorations. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what I'm working on today. So let me know in the comments below what you guys are working on today and feel free to share any links or anything like that so that we can all check them out. And yeah, I'm going to pop this up real quick and uh, get out there with my boys and enjoy this warm day. Today, Devin's off work, but he's going to work the next two days, Thursday, Friday. And then he's off the whole weekend. So that's going to be fun. It's supposed to be sunny and warm. So we're going to get out and probably go to some parks and stuff. I told him I want to go to one that we've not been to. So we might have to drive a little bit further to get to a state park or something that's new to us. But anyways, I'm going to hop off and take this outside and crochet a little cake. <laughs> I'll see you guys. Probably tomorrow I will do a um, crocheting chat if I get a chance. It really depends on Jesse. He's kind of moody today. So uh, I don't know if he's gone through a growth spurt or what. But if he's still in a bad mood tomorrow, I probably won't get a chance to record a crocheting chat. But if he is in a good mood, then I will do that. Yeah, that's my plan. <laughs> I don't know. I'll see you in the next video for sure whenever I see you. <laughs> Bye guys.